Um, he does jump on people every once in a while, but let's see what he has so far. Jax, you sit. Hey, come. Sit. Good. He down. He down.
Jax have received. And one of the reasons why I brought him here is because I I knew that he was gonna be a big dog. He's a lab. I knew that he was gonna be real rowdy. And I just kind of like years down the line, I felt like it was gonna be an investment. And I years down the line, I wanted him to be trained. I, I wanted to know that I had a trained, obedient dog for people to want to be around, my family to want to be around. So that's why I um, took the time to bring him out, to bring him here. And two weeks, I think, was sufficient. I'm glad I didn't choose, go the cheaper route and choose the one week. I think two weeks was perfect. Um, I missed him, of course, but I knew he was getting the training and um, that he needed. And I felt like, obviously, like he he's so he's a totally different dog. He's so good. The walking outside, I feel super comfortable now taking him places. And that's my favorite part, heel. Um, and yeah, I feel like it was a good investment for the dog that I plan on having for the next, hopefully, 10, 15, 20 years. Would you recommend Off-Leash Canine to anyone else? Yes. Small dogs, big dogs, quiet, meek and loud ones, rowdy ones, I definitely recommend off-leash training to anybody with a dog who you especially want to be around other people who you want to be trained and obedient, taking places and stuff like that. Um, I think it's a good investment. Awesome. Thanks so much. Thank you.